can record people how are you guys doing welcome back to Tessis tv we are still on the gist about waiting the stuff for inside the palace of a only my wonderful people although miriam she no great rest at all at all for inside palace as we heard that she has been moving up and down planning on how to make sure that spinawomi didn't return and right now we heard that Olori Miriam has engaged again in a quarrel with Kabiese in the palace. Yes, that Olori Miriam is now blasting Kabiese in the palace for playing and toiling with their emotions. Why he knows truly that uh, he doesn't love and care for them. And now that uh, he has brought them into the palace to trap them and follow his heart desires. That is what we heard Miriam is telling Kabiesi this evening in the palace that uh, he is going to suffer for everything that he has done to them in this palace because they have given a lot, they have sacrificed a lot, praying to God that one day Kabiesi will love them the way they love him. But Kabiesi has refused and has channeled all his love and attention and care and everything that is God in him to Queen Naomi and Prince Tedine Kao. Yes. But one thing with uh, Miriam is that uh, she forgets that Kabiesi did not marry her because uh, Kabiesi loves her. Rather, Kabiesi, as we heard, allegedly married Miriam because of Miriam's connection, because of Miriam's um, high profile. Yes. Even other Aurorys, Kabiesi didn't marry them before because uh, Kabiesi loves them. They are the ones that force themselves into the palace. And right now that they are eating the fruit of their labor, they are now crying. Someone like Miriam doesn't want to keep calm. He keep on dragging Kabiesi every day by day. Saying, Kabiesi, I want your attention. Kabiesi, I want your love. Kabiesi, treat me fine. Without knowing that Kabiesi like this, so don't already wash and come off for Miriam Mata. Yes, Kabiesi, as we heard, has stopped Miriam from entering his chamber, has stopped Miriam from attending functions, has stopped Miriam from doing anything in the palace in order to force straight her to leave the palace. Even at that, although Miriam has stood her ground and said that I are no go leave palace for Queen Naomi to return yes and right now he she don't already see say uh, everything why don't they do for this inside palace so that i go fight kabi seo you know the work because earlier today she don't already summon the auroris for a meeting advising them that it is better for them to reunite together and fight this battle of naomi's return once and for all yes even uh, Miriam and, uh, uh, I mean, even uh, Temito Bay and uh, Elizabeth, we are also called in the meeting, with which we heard that Elizabeth disagreed with them. That Elizabeth said that as far as she is concerned in this palace, she no go harm Queen Naomi at all at all. So whatever it is that they are planning or want to do, let them go and do it on their own, that her hand will not be in it. And all of you, Miriam, she don't see, say, ah, no, I don't, they lose support. How I go take, make sure, say, this thing, where won't happen to us, you know, happen. And today, she no re rest again. She don't carry her wahala, she don't carry her basketball, she don't carry her quarrel. Uh, uh, enter Kavies' uh, chamber to go and quarrel him, to go and blast him. That he, uh, she, all of you, Miriam, has sacrificed a lot for her. I have given you so much money for your businesses. I have contributed a lot in the palace. I have bought plenty of gifts, cars. I have bring a proposal, a vacation proposal to you. You rejected them. Yes, you rejected my car gift. You rejected my vacation proposal. The other day we heard that uh, all of the Miriam's uh, people came from Ebira to visit Kabiesi to appease him with gold and other gifts, which Kabiesi also rejected. Yes, Kabiesi said that he is not going to collect anything at all at all from Olori Miriam. So right now, Miriam don't they talk, ah, upon everything, why they do for you? I know Sekwe Naomi, they do this kind thing for you. 
I know say when Naomi know they sacrifice half of what I'm sacrificing for you. And still, you do not want to care for me. You do not want to love me. You do not want to uphold me as the number one. You do not want to crown me the Yeye Lua of this source. What have I done wrong to you? As uh, already Miriam we heard was asking Kabiesi this service of question. We heard that Kabiesi did not even listen to her. Kabiesi paid deaf ears to everything where Orori Miriam they talk. Because deep down Kabiesi's heart, Kabiesi knows that I did not love these people. Yes. Since they want to have their way in the palace, I gave them the opportunity. And here is Miriam is now blabbing. Saying that uh, I should reciprocate the love, I should do this. Yeah, how can Kabiesi reciprocate the love that he doesn't have for you guys? The only person where we know is say clearly that Kabiesi loves so much, that Kabiesi cares for, that Kabiesi provides for, is Queen Naomi. And up till today, Kabiesi is still providing for he, her and her prince, Tadine Kawo. He doesn't miss Queen Naomi's salary. He doesn't miss giving uh, Queen Naomi different gifts. He doesn't miss uh, taking Queen Naomi on a vacation. Yes. Because the Orori is thought that once they have their way into the palace, like I always tell Luna, that everything will be very okay for them. That they will be happy, that they will be celebrating like Queen Naomi without knowing that it is going to be totally different. Everything they envied about Queen Naomi and Kabiesi when they are together, thinking that if they enter palace now the same way, that they will be behaving with Kabiesi. It is different now. Kabiesi doesn't go to any occasion at all at all with them. Kabiesi always appear on his own this time around. We heard that the only time where Kabiesi went for an occasion with Olori Miriam was when the Tingo, Tingo Beverages uh, company was open due to we later heard allegedly that Olori Miriam contributed a huge amount of money in opening that business. And she later got angry with Kabiesi when he finally and said, Ah, this business, why I don't put huge amount of money in? Kabiesi don't already carry a will to Queen Naomi and Prince Tedenikau. And if you, it, it was even Prince Tedenikau's name that was used to open that uh, single privilege. All of you, Miriam, as we heard, she got so angry, she got so annoyed, she got so upset this evening after thinking about how Kabiesi is treating them and has decided to come in Kabiesi's chamber to blast him that he is not doing well, that the way he is treating her is uncalled for, and uh, she is not going to accept that again. That Kabiesi should better retrace he has, uh, his step before things will get tough for all of them in the palace. My correct people are waiting there so for inside the palace of Oni. As already Miriam, she no agree, keep calm. She don't de blast Kabiesi, say, Kabiesi, this time around, you better look after me or I will deal with all of you in the palace. I bet my correct, correct people make a man for this matter. Drop your comments at the comment section and do not forget to give this video a thumbs up and always uh, click on your notification bell to always get updates from us about waiting the sub for inside the palace of Oni. And for my returning subscribers, thank you guys for always coming by.